nshuti muvandimwe turakunezerewe kandi turakwakiye muri gahunda idasanzwe ni ya gahunda umaze kumenyera ubu yo kwitungira amagara turi muri Wima Institute ni muri California y'amajyaruguru ikigo kishuri uyu mushiki wacu Esther Akoramo numu mama ukunda imana numu mama ukunda Yesu kandi akunda nabantu arimo ragufasha nta mafaranga ari gukorera ni ku buntu gusa no kugira ngo kugira inama kandi twamushimira yuko yitanze akemera kudufasha imana igumugisha Esther welcome thank you thank you uh, hello thank you for watching uh, we're going to talk today about charcoal simple remedies with charcoal urakoze cyane kubukurikiye gahunda tugiye kuganira none kubyerekiranye namakara we had a first part hari gice cy'ambere cyatambutse we talk about uses for charcoal internally twabuze uburyo umuntu akoresha amakara imbere but today we're going to talk about uh, the uses externally uyu munsi tugiye kuvugana no uburyo uyakoresha inyuma Everyone should have charcoal at home. Buri muntu wese yagombye kuba afite amakara mu rugo. We said charcoal doesn't have any odor. Ntabwo amakara agira impumuro runaka. No flavor. Ntabwo agira uburyo herunaka. And they make it out of uh, burning wood. Kandi abayaturutse mu giti batwitse. Uh, like oak, pine, eucalyptus. Ibyo byose ariko hiyongeye cyane ntusu tuzi. And also coconut shells. Ndetse na coconut. Charcoal is so powerful that it will reach the bacteria that is many meters away from from it kuburyo abasha gukurura uburozi buri muri metero nyinshi cyane kure yako it's it acts like a magnet bisameze nka nka sumaku nkayema you can use charcoal for poisoning ushora kuyifashisha bari uburozi infections cyangwa ufite infection runaka pain and inflammation cyangwa ufite ahantu hakurya cyangwa hatangiye gututumba kubimba any digestive problems cyangwa ufite ikibazo kigogora mu mubiri and insect and spider bites ukabari we naga koko runaka cyangwa se n'igitagangurirwa and some snake bites ndetse nubwo ko bw'inzoka runaka and this is how it looks under the microscope iyo yarebeye muri microscope so we have these two words absorb and adsorb ahara amagambo abiri akoreshwa rero kwa absorba no kunyunyuza what's the difference na no na adsorb ni ibintu bibiri nyuranye bistandukanira niri so absorption is like a sponge kwa absorption ni 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 nka eponge ni ikintu gikurura nyine kikazamura amazi kikayafata a sponge absorbs water and it swells up. Icyo kintu kigifufuma cyangwa kirafata amazi, maze cyarangiye kikabyimba. Kuko ayiyongeye muri cyo. Adsorption. Ariko adsorb, yo adsorption is more like a magnet. Yo ni nkayema. It attracts. Ara kirakurura. And it bitakeyire. It doesn't let go. Kandi ntikirekure ngo But it doesn't change the structure. Kandi ntigihinduke. That's what charcoal does. Absorb. Ni chamakara rakora. So you can find charcoal in powder and capsules and tablets. Ushobora ko kubona makara mu tunini muri twa tunini dufitemo aga plastique cyangwa se no 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 mu gafu. Ayo na makara aba yatwikiwe ahantu hatari oxygene hatari umwuka ari ukuntu bayategura uguza yateguye neza biba ari byo byiza. I like to travel with tablets. Nkunda iyo ndi mu ngendo kugenda no tunini nkutungutu. Because if I feel sick Kukiyo numvise nsa nurwaye I I take like four mfata nka tune and take it nka tumira but I don't swallow it ariko sinkamire nabo nkamira ah ngashira mu karabo I allow it to dissolve around my throat oh, my tongue oh ndakareka ko kakazashongera hafi y'urimi rwanje kagenda so then the charcoal stays around my my throat my mouth area ah kakaguma hanga aha rero mu nkanka no mu mbese hafa ho ngaho also you can brush your teeth with charcoal. Ariko shano no kwifashisha namakara uka uka brosa menye. It helps to whiten your teeth. Bituma menye ya warusha kubumwero. Or if you have gingivitis infection? Ni ufite indwara in your gums? Indwara kwishinya. It helps for the infection. Nabyo biragufasha bigatuma infection ikira. Um they have charcoal patches. Hari ututuntu rero natwo twa Ningikintu baza bakabadika ku mubiri This company Black Ice Uru Rwanda bita Black Ice blackicepatch.com Uru blackicepatch.com It's good when you travel because you you don't have to take the powder with you 
ni byiza yuko uri kugenda ku rugero naka nako wabugafite you can just peel it and apply it icyo gihe ufite nk'ikibazo ahantu ura ufite ikibazo ku mubiri cyari cyo cyose ubasha uragatonora ugakura hagashuka kamwe ukabadika ukagafata but i'm gonna teach you how to make this type of patch at home ariko ndi bukwigishe uburyo wagi wikorera iwawe mu rugo how to make the the activated chaco is it possible at all we're going to make it at home okay ati ndi bukwigishe uburyo ukora ya makara meza no mu rugo this company also has a mask iyi company rwo twavugaga ifite na na mask with a filter iyi mask ifite nka filtre na kantu kakayunguruzo it has charcoal inside ah kakayunguruzo kari mwa makara imbere nubwo bisa naho bitagaragara the mask has a pocket hanyuma rero iyi mask ifite kantu kagafuka imbere and it protects the air kandi ituma nyina umwuka udafa kwinjira by absorbing uh, pollution ah kakantu kagenuka gashyira mu imbere hano hanyuma kakazatangira umwuka mu byamakara ntatuma imyanda yari yose yabari virus cyangwa iki yinje your charcoal at home is never gonna expire ntabwo makara yawe ajya gira igihe ngo arangize ubuziranenge ah but you have to keep it closed ariko ugomba guhura yapfundikiye if you leave it open kuko iyo yaretse akabafunguye gutya you wanna guess what's gonna happen uzikiri bube It's attracting everything that's contamination from the environment. Imyanda yose wibuke ko icyakora nungukurura imyanda. Ngo rero imyanda yose ivari yose arayakuru arayikurura. So to keep it clean you need to keep it. Ugo rero kugira amakara yawe atazo mu yamyanda ngo yikurure ni ngombwa kuyapfundikira. So um let's talk about some external uses. Deka tuvuge rero uburyo umuntu akoresha amakara inyuma. You always it depends how big the area is. Bizaterwa naho ngaho nyine ushaka kuvura uko hangana. But is usually one part of thickener? Eh, uh, Something to make it thick like a butter. Eh kugira ngo yumakara abyimbe aho yashyira and one part of the charcoal? Eh ufata ikintu icyo gijyo bita thickener hanyuma ukavanga na makara and three parts warm water. Uh, ukavangana i need to know I'll, the measures I'll, again i'll show you yeah. i'll show you hanyuma warangiza ugashiramo namaza hyuye so let's let's make it so tugiye kubikora for thickener i have today um flax seed iyo kintu kitwa thickener gituma biza gufata afite ni impeke bita flax seed flax seed is good because it's anti inflammatory hano muri america zirahari ngo zirwanya inflammation and absorbs water and makes a nice thick butter zikurure rero amazi zigatuma nyine bihinduka nka bere nk'ikintu gifashe cy'umutsima but if you don't have flax seed ariko ari udafite flax seed udafite ututu ututuntu you can use corn starch ushora gukoresha ibigori you can use shred potato ushora gukoresha what kind of potato sweet or any kind ibijumba cyangwa ibirayi wa wa bayi nkusya and then ukabihinduramo uh, agatsima and you can and you can use um oats usha ukoresha oats oats warazigurisha muri za supermarché or olive oats oil oil chawo gakoresha ya mavuta ya olive twavuze you just need something to make a paste bese nu kugira ngo ukora akantu kameze nk'agatsima so i'm gonna put one one teaspoon of ngiye gukwifasha rero akayiko kamakara of the flaxseed and one oh akayiko kirya flaxseed nakayiko kamaka charcoal nakayiko nikiko kamakara and then three parts water hanyuma nshire mu inshire eshatu za amazi so if i use one niba nakoresheje kanu kayiko kamwe then i'm going to use three of water no no nje gukoresha rero dutatu twamazi so one nje gukoresha dutatu twamazi two to be and three the second one wasn't very well full let's see okay Wow. You're going to mix it and make a paste. Mm. Tugero kuyavanga dukora ikintu kimeze nk'agatsima. You can leave it rest and Ushora kuyareka bikaba bigumye mu hari aho gakeya to allow the flax seed to Kugira ngo flax seed zise naho zishonze zitote zitote puffy. Eh kuko no tubuto. Ngo ni tujya kumera nk'uburo. Like a butter. Tujya kumera nk'uburo. So Pedro was playing tennis. Pedro no yakinaga tennis. And he said his his arm is hurting. No, ne abuze uko ukuboko kwe kumumereye nabi kuri kumurya. And I think is is his pain is because he has inflammation. Ah, fite kibazo cya inflammation ko ko atangiye kugira ikibazo. So I don't have uh only only what I have at home is 
paper. And plastic. If you don't have this type of plastic, you can cut any any uh, plastic from this, like a plastic bag. And the reason you need the plastic is to keep it moist. And then you need a bandage, <coughs> any type of bandage. Um, or a piece of cloth to, to wrap it. So I'm going to uh, put this on the, on the napkin. This is like paste. Nice and like a, like a gelatin. So you're going to make like a sandwich. And it depends how big the area is. Make sure you leave ah. a space on the side so it won't spread out. Now, this is, uh, I want you to remember, if you have a snake bite, please don't spend time making this. Just get some water. If you don't have water, let's say you're camping. I would use a spit and some powder make a paste and put it directly on the skin. You have to act quick and go to the hospital for spider, any poisonous um, uh, insect. You can put it directly on the skin. The only reason we use napkin is to prevent a stain. But you can easily wash it. So it's going to go across the napkin. So it's, it's, it's just protecting a little bit from staining the skin. So I'm going to ask Pedro to come. Pedro, come here. And um, show me where it hurts. Okay, right here. So, all the way here. So I'm going to apply it. Be very careful. It's nice and cool. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to wrap it. Hold it. So any type of plastic, if you have this type of plastic, or a piece of, uh, a, um, a piece of, um, no, like a plastic bag from the store. And we're going to keep it around just to keep it nice and warm. There you go. And then we're going to wrap it. It doesn't have to be tight, it's just enough to hold it. And then he can sleep. He can go to bed with this. And then in the morning, uh, you can remove it. Um, if it's an infection, uh, every two, uh, no more than two hours, you need to remove it. If it's a snake bite, 15 minutes and you put a new one. Let's say it's the morning and Pedro is feeling better. I'm going to remove the bandage. If, it's, if I didn't use this for infection, you can take it. You can dry this out on the sun and then put it in a bag and you can reuse it. But and if it's, you add some oil, you could add more water or oil to make it. So, if it is not infection. So I would, let me show you. Mm. I would put it here. Mm. Oops. Sorry. Mm -hmm. 
Now, if it's infection, Niba ni chwazo cha infection. Then uh, now if you put it in the sun it's going to get dry so it's going to get easier to to get from the napkin. Oh, umuntu haba yabyanditse kuzuba kugira ngo bize kuvaho bize kuza bijye mwaha. Remember? Bijye mu hariya neza. You can put it in the freezer. Ushatse wabishyira muri frigo. Muri freezer. Add more water. Ushaka kongera mutuzo ushatse and reuse it. Ukazonye ukabikoresha. Biba yatari infection if it is not infection. If it's infection. Ariko biba yari infection. This is full of bacteria or Hano baba hamaze kuzura mu nyanda. And then you have to discard. Cyangwa inzoka. Maybe snake also it's full of. Also poison. Niba ni inzoka bwo byabaye buruze cyo gihe no kubira. You can reuse it only when it's inflammation. Cyeretse ari inflammation yenda yavunitse. You can use on the on your ankle, on your foot. Wagize ikibazo ku kirenge, wagize ikibazo kugomba bari. Aha ntari ho hose. What if um uh, he told me he had ear ear ache. Okay. Ah tubwire ko yambiye ko afite ikibazo cy'ugutwi. So then I I use a small ndakoresha gatoya a small piece of um, napkin ngiye gukoresha akantu gatoya and then you're going to put it ako kantu gatoya doraga kata kuri akantu tuno tuno duhanagura in the in the napkin ashizeho rero ka gatsima and i'm going to try to put it as much as possible inside the ear hagiye ugashira mu gutwi mu buryo bushoboka bwose akegereze aho mu gutwi imbere and then you can put some tape if you have tape ni bufite akantu ka spradara ko bufatisha or something to to hold it akantu ko kubifatisha arabiziritse And he can sleep like this. Hanyuma ashora kujya kuryama rwo gutye. Or or just tape. If you have tape this that way he is not. Uramutse ufite akantu kazirika icyo gihe ntago wakwirwa uzirika aho hose wazirika. So you can use uh, like a patch for example for the eye if you have a eye infection. Uramutse ufite ikibazo cy'ijisho. Same thing. Cut. Hanyuma yagize infection wakoresha patch. Cut a round piece of um, your napkin. Ushara gukoresha akantu kameza hagatambaro any kind of clothing material clothing material no napkin mhm okay just napkin akantu kameze like this type same this type mhm with the charcoal inside and then put it on your eye warangiza ukawashyizemo kwa kundi and then you can rest for 2 hours eh ukaruhuka nk'amasaha agera kuri abiri thank you pedro so this is this is very um very easy but very powerful ikintu kirasa nicyoroshye cyane ariko ni ikintu kigira kamaro cyane you can use it uh, every time you have pain inflammation infection ushaka kubyifasha igihe cyose ufite antu akubabaza igihe kibase ufite inflammation inflammation cyangwa se wagize na infection haje mu bubore hatangiye kuzama ikibazo there are many stories but i'm going to tell you one um hari amakuru menshi avuga kuri iki kintu ariko ndashaka kukubwira imwe muri zo someone that had an infection after surgery umuntu wagize infection bamaze kumubaga hazama infection um he had a lot of pain yarababaraga cyane because inside the incision kuko handi bari bakase there was a lot of pus infection hari harimo amashira and that was making gas and jatu magarero anagira na gaze asorera hanzu amuka hasumuka and the scar was stretching kandi iyo nkovu nayo yari rimisa ni rekurana so i said do you want to try charcoal nza kumubaza ndamaze ntese urashaka kugerageza makara and someone said what if something bad happens at mwaravuga tese none se hagize ikintu kibi kiba and i thought i think the lord will help us and ndamugira ngo ndatekereza ko imana iri budufashe it never fails ntabwo imana igitsindwa so then i got as clean as possible nuko nza gufata akantu we went to the pharmacy twagiye kuri pharmacy so we bought sterile gloves dushaka what is that gloves dushaka ya masogisi yo muntu ki 
and we yeah, we know, we know. instead of using paper we bought the sterile water you can buy it in the pharmacy water that is sterile and this is clean too Dufata. Goss. Sorry, I don't no? have it Go, like goss uh, the, you know in the hospital they put goss yeah yeah bafata ka kantu bajya bakira nkantu haje gisebe ba 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 bo meka ho kagafata that one is sterile it's yeah. not kabari sterile kabaka ka tunganyijwe nta myandi bikariho yes and then the water was a sterile water not just from the faucet na amazi ntabwo yaravye muri robin ahubwo yari amazi nayo ari sterilize ya amazi meza amazima you bought it in pharmacy as well yes and then we make the poultice and then we put on the gauze but I was wearing gloves make sure there's no infection coming and we put it on the skin on the how wound how is that thing long on the usually wound. it is small right this is a surgery or the thing you cover it was long oh. incision mm -hmm. long mm -hmm. it was this long so we put it all over the infection and we cover it with tape with tape, paper tape so after two hours we remove and we put another one and then he went to sleep and then about three four hours we, we removed. first time in seven days she had no pain I said, we will put another one tonight. And the patient said, no, put another one now. So we put morning and afternoon. And next time we went to the doctor. The doctor said, very good. He says the, the recovery is perfect. But before the charcoal, the patient was not recovering. And the doctor said, if you don't recover because the antibiotics are not working, we will have to open again. This is why the patient says, let's try charcoal. So I'm going to read to you this quote that I really like. We cannot expect the Lord to work a miracle for us. While we neglect the simple remedies he has provided for our use. Which aptly and opportunely applied will bring a miraculous result. Therefore, pray, believe, and work. Thank you very much for listening. God bless you. Thank you, Esther.